Welcome back, Whippersnappers. This is Gramps. We are in Shapes, the original. We are at the final stages, I think, of our Make Anything machine. So off camera, I went ahead and I ran to these other three areas here, all of the colors and shapes. So we got color shapes. I ran the colors and shapes all in the same order, just because. Didn't, you know. It's not necessary, um, but I just did because of, you know, that's just the way my brain works best. <laughs> it makes it easier to troubleshoot if need be. Um, as we're cruising along here, if you're enjoying these, please toss me a like and a subscribe. I'm trying to get up to 50. We're, you know, we're getting there. We're closing in on it. I've also just started a whole new series uh, with a game completely different from Shapes. It's called V Rising. It's a uh, sort of a third-person um, vampire game. It's a lot of fun. I, I play it a lot. <laughs> and uh, there is a new, or a, a, a 1.0 release coming out. It's been out in, pre, uh, in early access for quite a while now. And I have been playing it. Uh, but the 1.0 release is coming out on May 8th, 2024. So looking forward to that and getting it going. So what I have done here too is I changed our shape to be our um, to be this guy, our uh, blueprint shape. And I just did that here. So again, with the constant combinator, that's what's sending out to everything. So you can see that is what's feeding in which is great, but we still need to do some wiring. I figured out what was going, I think I figured out, we will see. One of the things I need to do is connect this up to here. All right, so this section is connected. Then, uh, we do not need this, Doink. but we are going to connect this up here. So that connects the lower half, the, the lower two sections with the upper two sections and gives us what we need. But then also up here, we're getting rid of that. So I think that's what is going to work. Again, it looks like it's all coming in and working. We seem to be low on something. I don't know why why these are going so slowly. Uh, <laughs> looks like, are we low on shapes? Ah, that's why. Okay, it's just taking a while. You know, once everything gets all stocked up, then we'll be good to go. So I am going to do the next step. So the next step from here is that we want to, oops, we're going to start feeding these shapes from the MAM into their holders. So let's do that. Let's get that all settled here. And I think that's probably good. Oh my goodness. You can hear the dogs. <laughs> Being ridiculous. All right. Um, <laughs> let's do it like so. this to there and oops to there it doesn't matter which of these we feed into there we go So we can do that and get rid of that. Um, we can do this one differently. 
And let's do this. Yep. There we go. Okay. Sometimes with the uh, flicker rate, it looks like the arrows are <laughs> going backwards. That is not great. We don't like that. Um, the other thing I'm doing is I'm going to take this guy and flip him around and put him here. And that is going to be our timer to do the release to set loose all of the uh, all the stored shapes. Okay, so let's do this. And can we copy this? I don't know. Let's give it a try. I don't think that's going to work. No, well, kind of. I just need to clean it up a little bit. I'll do this and that. And yeah, we still have, let's get this guy going. All right. So one feeds off to there to fill those four. One feeds off here to fill these four. Then it's gonna come in here. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here and do a little roundabout. And for the beginning, Beginning, starting off here, we're just going to do a small one. Then we can add to it as time goes by. So there's a loop, there's a loop, there's a loop we need. And we may have to reposition some of this stuff. So then this guy's going to come out here like so. Then go in there. Uh huh. And we're want to filter. Oops. That's a cool thing, actually. You can see, you know, when when we're holding an element that can be connected to wires, it shows it highlights the wires underneath. So that's that's pretty groovy. And let's see, we need a merge here. Like so. So this will um, take the shapes in, but it will kick them out on this side. As you can see with the star, this is the priority side it kicks out. Once it, and then it's going to back up. Once it backs up, then it's going to kick one out here, which is going to come and go woo, 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 zipping along. Once it does that, it's going to hit our meter. And once it hits the meter, that is what is going to release the beasts. Okay. So, like I said, I may have to mess around with that um, to get it wired in correctly. But for right now, let's go ahead and get this going. So this is going to start, yeah, coming into all these. Okay. All right. So let's let's wire these up. Now this whole wiring section is completely separated from all of this, so it's not a big deal. Uh, again, we we do have this filter, which is our trash cans. To make sure the right shapes are coming through. I think we need to just go ahead and delete all these guys, which means things are probably going to stop for a minute. Um, yeah, that and this. And then we can get rid of, oops, get rid of these little switches here. Yeah, see, it's just going to start putting those into storage, which is okay. 
And then these are, oh, why are we not getting, aha. Uh -huh. So there you go. Okay. And yes, these are all stocking up, which is good. I just had one backward belt over here. Okay. Let's go into the wire zone. All right, um, so first I'm going to bring it over to there. Next, I'm gonna bring it down here. So out of the way. We're gonna have to wire up all of these guys. I think we can do like so. And that's, yeah, that's that way. Um, <laughs> okay, now we're going to need to mess around with some blue wires. That's okay. <laughs> All right, and you can see, yes, now it has gone through here, but it's not triggering the the filter because there's nothing, um, this wire isn't connected to anything. Okay. Oh, these are the release buckets. Okay. Sorry, this is um, this is where it gets tricky. What can I say? Let me look. Um, I've got some notes here that I'm looking at. Right. Yeah. Ooh, hello. <laughs> you know, we can let I'm just gonna go ahead and connect and release all of those for now. Okay, for the most part. But then we've still got all these up here. Let's take this and copy it around. For here and up here and down here, which we don't have anything in these ones yet. I'm going to eventually have more of the uh, this shape, this purple guy. Going, I'm going to double these up. So I've got another lane over here. So I'm going to double those up. Have these ones come in here. Have another batch come in here and then I'm going to reroute these ones I think down through here and over and in so we'll have eight of these coming in which is good okay that's good now let's take this but we don't want that little bit uh. Okay. All right, so that's, sorry, talking to myself. Cancel. Boink. Okay, so we've got those. Then these guys, we're going to maybe go up this way. No. That, that doesn't work. Hmm. All right, I may need to rework some of this stuff here. Maybe if I move this filter up one. And boink boink. Okay, so that is reworked. Yes, now we can wire here. 
in here. Connect those together. So these ones are kind of opposite of the other ones, which is okay. Copy those and yeah, put them here. Is that right? No, that is definitely not right. Delete. There. Does that work? No, that works. Okay. All right. So now we've got everything wired out separately. And I'm also going to, I'm just going to get rid of that constant combinator. Just so we don't have anything going in. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in a different constant combinator of this shape. Okay, and that's going to help. That's going to clear out all everything that's built up. Okay, or most of it. Okay. So now we have a fun little connection project. <laughs> of um, we want to make it so only the main shapes, the either the upgrade shapes are rolling or the level shapes are rolling through. So that's going to be using or gates and not gates. So looking at my notes, <laughs> okay. Got it, I think. Boy, there's a reason why I, this is not my work. <laughs> uh, it's perfectly logical, though. And I'm a pretty logical person. So we should be able to get this. Okay, so I'm going to bring this down to here. And then I'm going to use a little uh, wire isolator. And here I'm going to use a, I think an OR gate. Yeah. All right, I'm putting an OR gate here that's connected to that and connected up here. And this is going to come off here, but here we've got the plus because we don't want anything on this side except we are going to connect a blue one in over there okay so i'm gonna pull these down okay so now let's get the blue wire out blue wire okay so this is where it's going to get tricky just because of positioning And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to reposition some of this here. And back here. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oops, did not want to do that. Okay, so that gives us a little bit more flex room up here. Okay, and I'm going to bring this thread up here. Give a little um, connector there and there. Oh, but then that's separate, so I don't want that. 
So that's okay, I can do this. There. And now that's the same wire. To over here. Then I'm doing a not gate. And connecting it to there. Okay. All right. Um, so this is getting part of the way there. Now we need to thread this around. So it should be going here too. And again, not gate. Okay, so these are open and would be flowing through. Then we need to get all those same signals up to here, again, triggered by this guy. So I need to be connected up to this and this. So let's try a little cross over here. <laughs> oh, this is our what is this? This is our main signal. Okay, so we're just going to leap over that, but also going to put a not gate in here. And then a green one. Yep, so that's good. Now, can we just connect these? Okay, that might work. V chassis. Okay, so that has all the non level shapes working. But again, once this goes through, once one of them feeds through here, we want this to trigger a one, which should open up these filters, these filters, and these, and these. So right now that's a zero. Okay. So I know that what I had was it was coming way down here and way up here with a crossover. Oh, that's a little ugly. Okay. So this comes around. Again, you can see it's a zero, which is good. That's what we want. Now, what if these were connected? Now we can't connect through there. So I think we can connect here. Oh, my. Crossover, crossover, and crossover. All right, so does that work? One, ba, ba, ba. Okay, so let's see. We're going to need to get rid of that and replace it. 
that did not work. Because right now, we should have a one. Uh, I think it's the other side. No, that's still not. Uh, it's only f that's giving us that signal. That's g <laughs> okay. Why are we getting the signal of the? Oh, I think that's what it is. Okay, on one side it gets gives you a number. The other side it gives you the shape. Okay, so that's fine. So that means we do want it back up here. Trying again. Yeah, so that gave us a one for a second. But I don't think it um, triggered what we want, which is the mass release. And then it should stay, those should stay open until they're all cleared out. <laughs> I'm sorry. Again, looking at notes. Okay, I see one thing that's different is that we had... Yeah, so we've got meters on the ends of these guys here. So, for instance, here. And I think that is what helps keep it open. Maybe it's this. No. Okay, all right, so let's do this. Let's put in a constant here of one. Yeah, it does not like this. Oh my goodness. Is it because of all that? <laughs> it very well could be. Okay, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to do some troubleshooting. I will come back and I will fix it and I will explain it. I think I have it fixed. This is another sample run. Crossing my fingers. I'm pretty sure these... These guys will work. I just don't know about these guys. And here we go. Okay, these guys are working. Oh, look at that. Yay. Oh, my goodness. They're all working. Hallelujah. And they are completely emptying out, which is great. Let's do a real test. Gonna shut that down and put in the actual shape. So now we should be making this shape. And you can see now that we, because I turned that off, that got these guys all started again. So again, going back here, all of these bad shapes are now emptying into the trash. And you're gonna start seeing different things coming through. 
we still have some stuff built up. Now this would be an improvement that could be made is you know you could have all these stuff go these guys go off into the trash too if they weren't matching what needed to be made. But look, these are this is what we want. So we're gonna get some bad ones at first. They're gonna get backed up. <laughs> but see stuff like that is gonna come through and just gonna go into the trash. Okay, we're at the stage now where things are starting to roll through. And we should get a real one coming through here eventually. Hopefully quickly. I'm still seeing a lot of circles. <laughs> uh, those are looking more pointy. Oh, there we go. We've got real shapes coming through here, folks. This might do it. Now, all we need to do for this one, this level, is four per second, which is not a lot. And that's why I didn't worry about making this back and forth super long. As this becomes bigger and bigger, like, you know, eventually they're going to want a couple hundred per second. Then you can just make this timer longer and more of them get stockpiled. And then they're going to, you know, flush through faster. And by then, too, you will have upgraded belts, so things will move quicker. But right now, you see, we're getting about, about 35 in each section. All right, so here we go with the flush. And does that do it? That did it. Look at that. Level 27 done. Now we're on to level 28. So these are going to be done, and the other ones are going to start rolling in. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got ourselves a ma'am. Thank you again, Joe Mama 1973 Links to his videos are down below. And he is really the one who came up with this and got it going. So mm. let me show you what I what I did differently down here. So I, I actually kind of deleted everything and started over. And then I just started up in this section. So we've got the, um, these are the upgrade shapes versus the level shapes. So the level shapes will be in these inner ones and the upgrade shapes are in here. So basically using a, right now there's no signal going through any of these. So the only thing that's passing through are the upgrade shapes. They are rolling in. I also, and that's because we've got zeros here, so I have a not gate that tells us these are ones. I also disabled, at least temporarily, our little uh, blueprint shape bypass, just to make things simpler. I can rewire that later. But uh, just because of the, the way the wires were and all that, it was getting crazy. So that is all good. I might... Yeah, I think I can take this knot gate and I can put it like way up here. I can have these wires come over different ways. I can reroute them maybe up and over and something like that. Anyway, I'll figure it out. These are connected though. Here's the big thing is that this block and this block are connected here. So with this guy. Now we're starting to get these new shapes in and right now it's gonna flush through. So look, this has now turned into a one, which means we are in the flush system and we've got our new shape. 2829. Now, it's taken some time to get back to the the upgrade shapes, and that's because this this little guy here is probably too long for what we need right now. But that's okay. And again, we can we could shorten it like that. And that would still give us our upgrade and it would turn things quicker. But eventually we're going to get to a point where you know, we're not going to have any, um, it, it's the flesh is not going to work. It's not going to trigger the new shape. So now this one is still two layers. I'm not sure when we go up to three layers, but once we do go up to three layers, oh my goodness, we are still not set for that. <laughs> okay. So once we go up to three layers, then what we need is this. So this is easy. Yeah, right in here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to do this. So that will be our three and four layers.
nice and easy. So right now these are all getting zeros because we know that they're getting zeros from down here because there's no third and fourth layer. So these are all dead right now. Oh, there goes another one, level 29 completed. So anyway, we are working. The next thing I'm going to do to get this really dialed in is, like I said, I'm going to double up these guys. So I'm going to do that off camera, but then I will come back and show it to you, show you how it looks, because it's going to be a little ugly. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be ugly. And I'm probably going to rework a lot of this stuff. In fact, uh, yeah, I am. Yeah, it'd be nice if we could get these guys um, zeroed out of here. I may have to see if I can figure that out, but I don't know offhand. But that's okay. It's not a big deal. Again, it just takes a little bit of working. It feeds enough shapes in that those eventually get blown out, and then you start getting the real shapes like this. Okay. Excellent. Gang, we are almost done here. And it is just going to keep going and going and going. And then we just sit back and let it rock. So, Joe Mama 1973, you are amazing. You're you are a hero. Here goes our flesh. Look at that. Skadoosh. Those are going in. Full speed. Let's look at our upgrades. Um, this needs to be, yeah, 240. So we're over that. And then, so we were already, I bumped it up to 16. Oh, this needs to be 440,000. So we can't do a full upgrade yet. This one's good. But see, that's why now this one's going to start lagging because it requires so many more than these almost double. So that is why we're going to do that. So we'll get that going. Gang, thank you so much for joining me today. And like I said, if you enjoy the video, toss me a like and a subscribe. Um, go over and check out V Rising if you're interested in that at all. It's a fun game. Uh, 1.0 is coming out, and it's going to be a blast. It's um, it's good stuff. So thank you once again. This is Gramps signing off.